Hi, my name's Kim, Kim Anderson. I am a Canada Research Chair in Indigenous Relationships here at the University of Guelph. My home department is Family Relations and Applied Nutrition, where I'm an Associate Professor. I've been part of the community of Guelph, the city, and also the campus for over 20 years. I moved here from Toronto as a community member, started getting involved with the Aboriginal Resource Centre, and uh, eventually did my PhD in the Department of History here. So I'm a long-time wealthy and campus community member. A lot of my research has to do with gender and indigeneity. I identify as Indigenous feminist, so I've done lots of work in Indigenous feminisms, and I've recently, more recently doing work in Indigenous masculinities. And lately I've been doing uh, all sorts of stuff around indigenizing the campus. So right here on the campus of Guelph, we've had some research going on around language, how we bring language into the campus, around land-based uh, activity and social relations. So land, language and social relations are, are kind of domains that I try to think of about bringing my uh, work into. In terms of land, we have uh, Wasak to Winnewak um, Collective, which is urban uh, gardening, indigenous urban gardening. And we have some tea gardens growing right here in the University Arboretum and we're looking at uh, the impact of those things. We also have uh, sacred fires that we're doing with Indigenous men. We've uh, started some uh, fires and sacred fire gatherings for Indigenous men and we're looking at how those things can impact the wellness uh, of men. And then in terms of language, we've had a project going on around looking at how do we infuse Indigenous language, and in particular Anishinaabema one, as part of the everyday good living of campus. So not just for the curriculum, but also um, how do we start to live that in terms of naming things, in terms of how we can in infuse language into the, the everyday moments of our lives here on campus. I've really been enjoying um, working with students as well who have been doing a project called Picturing Decolonization in the College of Social and Applied Human Sciences, looking at how do we start to deconstruct and unpack ways in which we can look at bringing more Indigenous ways of knowing and ways of being into the, into the, into the campus.